Hi everyone, my name is Jenna Leiter. Um, I go by Jenna. Um, I use the pronouns her, hers, and she. Um, I currently live in Lorton, Virginia, which is about 20-25 minutes south of Washington, D.C. Um, my husband is active duty military and we are stationed here at Fort Belvoir. Um, I am in the Eastern Time Zone, so I'm in the same time zone as Louisville. I was in Colorado Springs, Colorado last um, semester, and that was a two-hour difference, so I'm grateful to be back um, in the same time zone and not having to worry about, you know, the two-hour difference. It helps with assignments and live chat sessions and such. Um, my practicum experience last year, um, I was working with the military community. I'm a military specialization um, student right now, and so I really enjoyed working with the active duty service members and their families. I worked for the Family Advocacy Program um, on post at Fort Carson in Colorado, and I worked mainly with the New Parent Support Program. And what that program is is a preventative um, education-based program that works to prevent um, spouse and child maltreatment, child abuse, um, domestic violence, and things of that nature. So we did a lot of preventative education. We provided a lot of parenting classes, um, positive discipline classes, um, how to, you know, create a nurturing and loving home, things like that, all in an effort to prevent um, domestic violence and abuse and maltreatment within the home. Um, because with the high stress levels of the military community and the nature of the job, um, sometimes domestic violence is quite an issue um, within this population group as far as child abuse and maltreatment as well. So we just provided a lot of um, proactive preventative education to um, military service members and their families. Um, where will I be this year for my practicum? I will also be working with um, the Family Advocacy Program here at Fort Belvoir. Um, for those who are not familiar with the military, there's two very different programs. Um, the one I'll be working with um, here at Fort Belvoir is actually more of the behavioral health side of the program. So I'll be dealing with a lot of substance abuse, um, PTSD, uh, there will be some domestic violence and abuse in there as well. Um, I'll be dealing with counseling um, and a few other things. I've had a very large curveball thrown my way with my practicum this semester. Um, so it's being delayed due to an error in, um, I guess, the affiliation agreement and it wasn't filled out correctly. So I have not yet started my practicum. There is not a set date for my practicum. Hopefully they're telling me in about a month or so I can start. So I'm going to have to be doing a lot of backtracking. Um, so I have not been able to sit down with my supervisor at this point in time to learn exactly what my duties will be, but I know I'll be working directly with um, the Behavioral Health Clinic and working directly with um, military service members and their families. Um, so that is as far as I know when my set date starts, I'm going to sit down with my supervisor and um, you know, kind of learn more about what exactly I'll be doing and where I can um, get the most benefit for my practicum with the program. And so when thinking about this class, are there any specific skills, theories, interventions of interest? Um, one of the ones that my supervisor did mention that they utilize a lot that I would like to study a little bit more um, is cognitive behavioral therapy. She says she uses that quite a bit in her work with her clients. Um, and so I'm going to focus my time on not specifically that one, but um, I'll be focusing a lot of time on studying that and also talking with her about how she implements that theory with the military population, or population um, and the client she serves. Um, so that's one of the ones that I'm interested in uh, learning a little bit more about at this point in time. And so my learning style is um, I'm a very visual person. I appreciate videos. I appreciate things written out. Um, I love to um, see it in front of me and I can, you know, physically handle it or physically see it being put into action um, and I just learn better that way. And one personal interest or fact about myself is that within the last eight months I have lived in four different states. <laughs> um, started out in Colorado, went to Michigan to stay with family for two months while my husband was away at training. I moved down to Alabama to spend two months with him while he was at training and we have now moved to Virginia. Um, so we've been living on a suitcase basically for about eight months now. So that's one little interesting tidbit about myself. Um, I look forward to listening to everyone else's intro videos and learning about you. 
Um, and I look forward to working with you all in this course. Thanks.